Well, San Marco has a new candy store, European Street Sweets, opened this month. And here to show us uh, some of the unique items that they offer is the owner. It's Andy Zarka. Thank you so much for coming in and bringing all this yummy stuff. I mean, you have a little bit of everything. Yeah, uh, we, we try to get our hands on just about anything that we can find. Uh, it's, it's been a lot of fun uh, sourcing all this stuff. So, you know, I know anyone that's been to European Street knows that you have this amazing candy section. Um, a lot of people, you know, walked in there and said, or they'd come in just to get the different candies that you have. That's really kind of the inspiration behind opening your own store. Absolutely. Um, we've always had a selection of you know, European chocolates and, and sweets as a part of what we do ever since we were in the mall as Mr. Dunnerbox mm -hmm. you know, 35 years ago. Um, so it was uh, just, it, it made sense for us to expand on what we already do in the stores and uh, you know, build on that and uh, have a lot of fun with it at the same time. All right, let's talk about some of the cool stuff that you have. Sure. Um, so with the European chocolates, one of the things that I'm probably most excited about are the, is the British line of Cadbury's mm -hmm. that we've been able to get back in. It's been three or four years, and uh, outside of Kinder Eggs, the, the number one candy that we get requests for are these crunchy and flake bars. Um, People these, go crazy over them. I yeah, know. I've heard, yeah, I've heard about it. Yeah, yeah, I've actually had one of the flake bars before, and I, they're delicious. Yeah, they're, and the, the honeycomb and that, that crunchy is like, it, the, there's no other American candy bar like it. And yep. so it's fun being able to get those. Um, a lot of the retro candy that, that people haven't seen um, in, in years, we've got Chico some of the, sticks. Exactly. Oh, I used to love those. And, it, and it's so funny. The best part about working at the, the stores, everybody that comes in just has a big smile on their face, yep. and they're happy. And mm -hmm. um, I mean, we had a we had a woman break down in tears because she hadn't seen some of this candy, oh. and it just it just reminded her of her childhood, and it was it was a great feeling to you know to be there and see it happen. So we have some of the old fashioned things, you know, that that we had we don't really see on the store shelves right. as much, and then we have some unique stuff. Um, bugs, you got bugs over we've here got, somewhere. We've Where got, are the bugs? We've got some bug candies. <laughs> yep, we've got ant lollipops and scorpion lollipops, and then if you if you just need crickets or, or larvae that, you know, they say crickets are the protein of the future. Yeah, I've heard. So I, I, you know, <laughs> I, I made Nick Michelucci eat one of those one time. Um, and then you have things like, what is this? Is this, a, is this candy? It's a, it's a gummy hamburger. Um, oh. And, and that's, we've actually got the full meal as well. Oh, wow. Where you wow. can get the gummy fries, the, you know, the gummy hamburger uh, and, the, <laughs> and the gummy uh, uh, um, soda. All right, bacon. People love bacon. You have a whole, we've got a whole slew closet. of thing for that, yes, right? Yes, we've got, we've got a bacon closet. Uh, and so anything bacon from bacon gumballs, bacon, bacon gumballs, bacon uh, gummies. Oh, bacon! Oh, look at that! Um, and then you know, it, every most people, the first time they see it, it, it doesn't make sense to them. You know, bacon and chocolate. Oh, things. oh, but the, makes the, sense the, to yeah, me. the salty and the, the smokiness sweet, yeah. that goes with that that sweet, and it's it's really a wonderful combination. It makes perfect sense to me. I want to talk about the pinatas too. Um, so, you know, these are a lot of fun, whether you're a kid or an adult, and you can kind of create your own deal. Absolutely. We've got, um, we've got 30 different bins of mm -hmm. uh, taffy and uh, hard candies that uh, you can fill up a bag and then uh, buy the pinata, take it home, fill it up. And we've got uh, all different styles of the pinatas, dinosaurs, unicorns, um, you know, more traditional, the Mexican Day of the Dead. Mm -hmm. Uh, well, lots of stuff. Lots of different stuff. And then let's talk about some of the gag gifts. You've got a bunch of, what is this? Uh, we, we've, we've brought in a line of parody prayer candles. Uh, these are two of my favorites. Obviously the Willy Wonka, but then the Kim with baby Yeezus oh. is, uh, <laughs> is one of my favorites. Makes me giggle. And then you even have, let's see, we've got unicorn poop over here. Yeah, the, in the, the... Toxic waste, all kinds of... The, the kids love the scatological jokes, so we've got uh, any number of um, poop-themed yep. items. <laughs> And um, booger-themed items. Uh, we, we like bringing in the big stuff, too. So a um, full half pound. Yeah. And then uh, this jawbreaker. Oh, is that a jawbreaker? Yeah, oh, that. my goodness. Oh, my good. Oh, this thing is like, I mean, a shot pounds. put. Yeah. <laughs> and then this giant yeah, uh, lollipop yeah, as well. Yeah, people come in and ask, what's the most expensive thing you have in yeah, the store? Yeah, what is it? And it's this, this lollipop. It comes complete with its own suitcase. It's a, it's a three-pound lollipop, and it goes for $49.99. Really? And that's the most expensive thing, huh? Yeah, I mean, if you have somebody that loves lollipops, or, you know, what I'm thinking, too, is if you have a Halloween costume. Oh, It would be yeah. perfect for that, you Absolutely. know? Yeah, well, I love it. Um, thank you for coming in. Do you have a favorite, by the way? That's, 
You have a favorite candy? The, um, right now, we brought in a line of uh, cotton candy. Yeah. Um, and they make all these amazing flavors. And the, the jalapeno cotton candy Ooh. is amazing. It's Again, really, really spicy good. and sweet. Exactly. Oh, that sounds really good, Andy. Yeah. Thank you so much. Well, European Street Sweets is located at 1670 San Marco Boulevard in San Marco. They are open every day from 11 a.m. until 7 p.m. Check out their Facebook page. You'll get some uh, great ideas there. European Street Sweets. Scott, back to you.